Hi friends, and welcome back to Bioshock Infinite. In our last video, we fought a ghost-ish, I think, Lady Comstock, and now we're running around opening more tears. It's to get more information, but I feel like that's a bad idea because I feel like all of this timey, whimey, wibbly, wobbly stuff going on <laughs> is not ending well for anybody. And there, there was something that was brought up in a recording, and it was a theory on our death. And like, this is where Rosalind mentioned that uh, Comstock had destroyed her machine and it's they're scattered amongst the possibility of space. So I wonder if that's why her and her brother just keep randomly popping up all over the place and, and they can't control where they are currently in existence. And they also mentioned something about finding someone to help solve the problem with the girl. And I'm wondering if they're the ones who hired Booker to begin with. But Columbia, can I go on this desk? Oh, only one obstacle. His office, 108 Bowery, New York. <gasps> they did hire him. I'm not crazy. <laughs> I'm not crazy. I mean, not completely. But anyway, so my last update was that I need to find the next tear. Two more tears remain. Follow Lady Comstock's footprints to find them. Because it's like exposing things from her past, which is also like Elizabeth's past, I think. And I feel like I got everything here and I'm ready to move on. And I'm always hitting the wrong. No, no, no. There we go. And I don't know why. <laughs> it's like, I don't play for like two days. Well, it's been longer than that, but I don't play for a few days. <laughs> and I completely forget where all my buttons are. No, the footprints aren't, footprints aren't creepy at all. But it wanted me to... Fine, we'll go this way. It's over here, right? Oh yeah, my... My things I left on the ground. changed. Oh, that's creepy. I hear her like whispering every so often. Financial district? Where are we going? Elizabeth is leading the way, like she knows where we're going. Water puddle? Oh yes, now I know where we are. To the- Oh my gosh! Retreat! Retreat! There's a call, Booker! Oh my gosh. No one escapes. Oh, yeah. 
Ouch, 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 ouch. You need to retreat a little bit. Don't walk in front of me. That would help. <laughs> Whew. Health and salts. No bad. Okay. Like almost dead, but I survived. <laughs> um, shotgun. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Good morning. That scared the crap out of me. I didn't like it. <laughs> and that was way too many people. I'm just saying. Huh. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I need to be prepared that I'm gonna get jump scared. <laughs> Every time I go to a tear, apparently. Huh. <sighs> I should have turned this guy on earlier. With all those crows. Oil spill wouldn't have done any good, probably. There was a fireman over here, but he, like, totally exploded. Is he, like, oh my gosh, were these people burned alive? Okay, so I'd look at my map to see if there's a vending machine nearby. I think there's one over here. I found some money. Want it? Yes. Yes, all the money is as per usual. Okay, I have my health back at least. Dollar bill. That's what I need. Dollar, dollar, dollar bill. Yes, we're just going to spend all the money on all the ammo. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it totally scared the crap out of me. Obviously, I keep saying it. Uh, my health back. I need salt, though. Maybe there'll be more inside the bank or something. It happened, right? <laughs> bank of the profit. Sure. Oh, no more jump scares, please. Okay, that way. I'll just double check that nothing has changed inside the bank. Weren't you just saying how she wasn't your mother? She got what she deserved? Interesting. This was not... These were here. This room was here. But... No, that's not creepy at all. <laughs> I don't 
think I see any box phones. See, this wasn't available last time. Oh yes, we'll leave the area. For a little while probably anyway. I mean, it's really beautiful looking. Oh, look, bad guys. Hi! Cutter's ball! Good now? Yeah? Okay. Got rid of the bad guys. <laughs> so let's start over here first. Because why not? I would hope there would be lots and lots of money in here, right? Gotta stop scaring the crap out of me. <laughs> I'm clearly very jump scary today. That's that. I need some box phones. We haven't had any yet today. All we've had is angry people fighting. See a carbine. I really did like the carbine. But I get more ammo here. So let's try this room. 50%. What's that? 50% of everything people earn here goes right to Comstock as a tithe. What? I gotta get me a job in the profit business. Uh, that's, um. That's horrible. I'm just saying. And then another carbine. On the shotgun, okay. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Can you open this? Looks easy enough. Better be, it only takes one lockpick. All done. <laughs> Gotta say, we're really cleaning up right now, which is awesome. Excuse me. No, you just stand right there and be in the way. It's totally fine. Yep, yep, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have an upstairs to still do on each side. Uh, thing to go down to the vault. We'll get there. There was also 
Dollar bill. Got a stock on all of our ammo. You know what would also be great is if when I did that to a vending machine, it made everything cheaper as well. I'm just saying. That'd be nice. Found some money. Take this. Hmm. I should have come upstairs. That would have been way better. Yeah. I'm not so smart sometimes with my... Did she just, like, jump over? Elizabeth! Beth. Okay, so let's... Take your time! I'm fine down here. Okay. Mm, nope. Okay. We'll take more salts, though. Thank you! Alright, down to the vault we shall go. But there are, okay, which one am I supposed to go into? That one, so let's go over here first. Because that's how it works, right? Hmm. Not a box phone. Going and going and going. I like how they make the footprints, footprints, the footsteps sound different when you're on a carpet. It's a nice extra little touch. Well, that's messed up. New shirt, Pyromaniac. When struck, 50% chance to burn nearby enemies. Victims take 400 damage over 30 seconds. I like haven't changed <laughs> my my gear, I think, since I started the game. <laughs> I probably should at this point, but I've been surviving so far, right? Barely in some situations. I definitely feel like it's starting to get a little harder. Combat wise. Not too terrible, but when they kind of jump out of nowhere, <laughs> and that's when it's bad. Find something of interest there? There's nothing on his desk. To be perfectly honest. Search. Search there. Search there. Okay. Order. Like the bank manager here. All right, let's see. Type three letters to spell the voice. Three letters. V O X. Try the typewriter. Oh, was this where the code is at or something? Or the, cause I got the, I got the cipher, but the puzzle is that over here, I guess. Nice. Oh, I'll be honest. I kind of, I kind of forgot about it. <laughs> More money. Take it. Thanks. We're in a bank, so I am finding lots of money. Ooh, box phone. Hurrah. So who is this one? The Imagination of God, Lady Comstock. January the 4th, 1895 Financial District. I know the prophet is a liar, but he cannot be. I know the prophet is a murderer, but he cannot be. Or if the future lies only in the imagination of God, why would he reveal it to such a monster? I don't know, sweetie. I don't kind of make these 
decision. I can't. I can't. I can't see anymore in the Grab safe. Is this one here? No. Which lockpick? What lockpick? Like, there's this locksmith here, but it won't let me pick it up. Okay. Find the box code. I did that. Maybe I haven't seen it yet? I'm... You know what? It's fine. That was the door to there. Okay. That is a really big safe door. Vault door. Vault door is better. Okay, let's go this way. Wasn't there an upstairs over here though? Wait a minute. I missed it. Yes, there was an upstairs over here. It doesn't go anywhere. Well, I checked. Is there really, did I really just not see the cipher anywhere? Or the, the, the box code message? Yeah, I really didn't. Hmm. It's right in front of my face, isn't it? And I'm just missing it completely. You know what? It's fine. We're moving on. Back here and then over here. All right. And let's go up the stairs here. Probably goes nowhere as well. But there's something to search at least. Balconies, the balcony areas are probably out there is probably what that is. They're just so happy to have 50% of their income taken away from them. That way, thought I could hear creepy noises. much better. <laughs> oh, the desk behind me. I've already... I, I'm facing this way, but the desk comes up. That's strange. Lock, lock pick? Lock Walker, there's pick. a lock pick over there. I know, but won't let me pick it up. I must have too many. Hmm. That would be my guess. I mean, I wanted to ask how you got up there, but then at the same time, I don't want to know how your dead body got up there.
Hmm. I thought I saw a crow gentleman up there. But maybe I was... Maybe it was just a ghost or something? Did I see a Vox phone or is that just money? I'm fine with money. Money's nice. Sniper rifle. I gotta say, this bank seems really large. It was a crow guy. Just keeps going. Interesting. What what's interesting? Book her a lockpick. Grab it. I can't. There's uh no more room in my lockpick pocket, apparently. Spectral psychic. Dropping a weapon creates a ghostly ally for a few seconds. No, I don't know how that could possibly be useful. Unless you're switching weapons, like you're dropping it and then picking it back up for reasons. Do we just jump, jump down? All right, we're here. I got him eventually. <laughs> Maybe electricity would be better on him. Maybe. Okay, let's see what this has to say. And if I do this, this uh, sabotage, all their patents, all of them is fake. Now, why does the prophet want these two killed? For the same reason Lady Comstock lies buried. Why does he want me to do it? Because only you can make it seem an accident. I don't think that's the real Lady Comstock. I think she's... I think she's a combination of herself and my feelings towards her. What do you mean? I'm yeah. just so angry. At her and at my father. I think she's her, but she's also partly me. I'm not even sure I understand it myself. Well, that's not helping me because I don't understand it at all. Okay. Let's hear what Comstock has to say. A Broken Circle, September the 10th, 1893 Financial District. The Archangel tells me that Columbia will only survive so long as my line sits the throne. Yet Lady Comstock produces no child. I have done what a man can do, yet there is no child. I've asked Lutessa about the matter, but even she refuses to help. So did they steal you? Create you? I found like some money. Want it? Hmm. I feel like there's no need to be like a bullet point explanation eventually <laughs> to to help me, but I'll get I'll get there, right? It'll it'll get there. At first, when 
they were talking about Fink and I forget who else it was was speaking. I thought they were talking about getting rid of the Lutes brother and sisters. Get out of her room. This is where we were. Find the final tear. She's really angry. Did you give birth to yourself? I'm, 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 this is all getting really weird. Oh, there's a safe down there. Maybe. Maybe. Can you get this open? On it. Ready. And this is Lady Comstock, no longer January the 5th, 1895, the vault. Lutes says the bastard is a creation not of her womb, but of some unholy science. I do not know which is true. The child is no more divine than I. What says that for my husband's prophecy? He begs my silence, but I can only offer him forgiveness. But with repentance need come truth. I can suffer his lies no longer. I kind of feel bad for Lady Comstock. Like, I don't know, I just, right now I kind of do. I'm sure she's evil and horrible, just like everybody else here. Okay, what is that? Oh my. There's angry. Thanks. This is not gonna go well. I gotta... Kill her. I am almost dead. Oh no. Oh no. Keep your eyes open. Partially healed, but you lose. So 
some money. Ugh. Uh, where do I need to go? Oh, that's right, over here. Yeah, you just kind of abandoned me, Elizabeth? Like, what's up with that? Where is she? I want to get up, is what I want to do. This isn't going well either. Where did she go? There she is. Elizabeth. different plan because this is not this is not hmm hmm okay I have long long drink of coffee that'll help right that'll help let's go we can do this Ammo. Yes. Can I like go to the vending machine mid fight? I can. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, let's uh. And then health kit. I'm not gonna lie. That's amazing. Huh. Oh, that was. I needed my machine gun. <laughs> Clearly, that's what I needed was my machine gun. Whoo! Yes, needed another st st stiff drink of coffee. <laughs> After all that, I do not like the fights with her at all. 
Like, how long can you allow her to survive before the corpses she raises from the dead just completely overtake you? Not long, apparently. Not, not long at all. And especially when you're at about half ammo. That doesn't really work. Okay, so let's see. I'm, I'd like to get out of here today. I just want to double check there's nothing. There's all sorts of ammo I could have probably just used. I could have switched guns most likely, but yeah, that didn't happen. <laughs> Okay. Out we shall go. Maybe. There we go. Yes, I would like to leave the area. I would very much like to be down here. I do like the mechanic where Elizabeth brings you back from... The brink of death. Just expected to get ambushed. That's where you want me to get off over here? Maybe? Yeah. Where I was supposed to go into the first time. And I went in the, the wrong direction. But got here eventually. I, I love I love maps. Like in general, I like maps. <laughs> yes, I am that nerd. Hmm. No, I'm not getting anything there. Let me go to the Veni Vidi Vigor. Okay, so Crow Strap causes the corpses of murder of crow victims to become crow traps. That might be useful because I do tend to use this one quite a bit. Possession for less. Increases duration. Oh yeah, and I keep forgetting to use the shield one. Increases stun duration. Let's get that one. Sun for less. Increases shield duration. And decreases... Salt needed. Uh, I want to get the crows one because I use that one the most. So maybe that will be helpful. Because then when they die, then they become another trap and anybody nearby them could, in theory, Caterpillar. hit it out. Achievement unlocked. Could, in theory, be attacked by crows. That's the rest of that sentence. But kit it out must mean I finished upgrading uh, at least one power. Maybe? I don't get to go into the apartments? Oh, that would have been a good one to go into. So I wonder which area we're going in here. Nope. Are you leading us to a sandwich in case I got hungry? Oh, the photo store maybe? Yeah. This one was locked. I remember, I remember things occasionally. Got a lock, needs some picking. <laughs> Seems easy enough. Got it. Thanks. Sorry, I gotta turn you off. Okay. Last tear. Let's do this. Maybe. But you two are dead. I took your funeral photo. Yes, and made an absolute hash of it. 
One doesn't expect a picture of one's cause. It's come across so lifelessly. <laughs> so the two they were talking about killing was Rosalind and Robert Lutes. The customer is late. Robert, Rupert Cunningham, November the 6th, 8, 1909, downtown Emporia. That's insanity. What proof would you have that Mr. Fink would hurt the Lutesses? The Lutesses told me. The Lutesses? When? Yesterday. Yesterday morning. Rupert! They've been dead these seven days. Yeah, so... They destroyed the machine, I remember that one, and then they were scattered across space and time, right? <laughs> um, 30, that must be my cap on lockpicks, I think. That would make sense. But, hmm. Okay, I, I can kind of work that out in my head because of their exposure to the machine and, and alternate universes and, and those timey-wimey things. Lots of Doctor Who references right now. <laughs> um, but it still doesn't explain where Elizabeth came from, her theory and her mom. I'm, um, we'll get there, right? Okay, so what's our next update? Return to Comstock House. I already did that. And it didn't click it off. Because I don't think I saw the code. Like the old-fashioned photo studios and things like that. So cute. Okay, so I would like to say I could just run there, but I feel like I'm gonna get ambushed. You hiding out there? There we go. Go ahead. I just crouch out in the middle of the open. In the open, not in the middle of the open. Sorry, <laughs> words. I'm clearly, I'm still drinking my coffee. <laughs> um, Dalla Bill is over here. Dalla Dalla Bill. Uh, let's get health kit, and then let's also get all, all the things in case I'm ambushed even further. It'll be fine, right? We went to the bank, we stole all the money. This way? This way, right? He killed Lady Comstock. Or Tessus. Yeah. Anyone who knew the truth was better dead than alive. I'm not even his daughter. I'm just some specimen to be poked and prodded. No, you are not. Elizabeth, listen to me. What you've been through, ain't nobody in the world deserves that. Booker. We are getting out of here, you got it? Never gonna have to look back. Yeah, let's go to Paris. Forget taking taking her to clear your debt. Let's just go to Paris. They have croissants there, and and it's Paris. <laughs> Turn to Comstock Gate to call the funicular. Oh, that's right. We needed the to do all this to. Something, something with the, the door to get in the gate and, or past the gate and all those things to, to take care of the bird so we can leave. I remember things. There seem to be way more corpses here than last time. Rosalind Lutes is not my mother. Neither are you. He 
killed you both. Yes. <laughs> I know you hate me for not being your daughter. And I hated you for not being my mother. Alicia! Welcome. I, I would like to not ever, ever do that again, please. Like, I don't need any more, like, not to sound mean, but like, I don't want any more therapy sessions, please, with your mom involved or like the mom that you created and brought back from the dead and then brought back wrong. I mean, I just, I would like to not do any of that anymore, please. <laughs> I just sound like a five-year-old, but you know. There were way more bodies. I wasn't wasn't crazy. Um, don't want the hand cannon. Still don't want the hand cannon. Okay. We are not exactly great on ammo, but we should be fine enough, I would hope. That at some point, she just destroyed the gates to let us in, basically. <laughs> After all that. <laughs> Blood in the streets achievement. All right, we made it to Comstock House. 
but I am at time for today. So on Saturday, we will pick back up here and finally begin exploring Comstock House. Hopefully find some ammo and some food so I can heal myself back up. But um, I suppose I could always leave and go do no i can't leave and go do all that but anyway we'll 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 just pick back up here on saturday and see how it goes <laughs> but as always thank you so very much for watching please do keep yourselves safe and i will see you again on saturday with another new bioshock infinite video